What's up guys, this is iTweets here with iPhoneHacks.com and if you haven't heard iOS 7.0.6 has been released and what it does is fix a huge security bug that basically leaves you vulnerable to hackers stealing your credit card information if you're purchasing things from your mobile device or anything like that. So I do recommend upgrading to 7.0.6 and I have a tutorial and I'll put a link in the description below for you guys how to jailbreak on that iOS version. Now, if you don't have time for that or you just want a quick fix, now I do recommend obviously to upgrade to 7.0.6, but this, like I said, is a quick fix. And it's actually uh, pretty easy to install. All it is is a tweak in Cydia, and it's from Ryan Petrich, so you are going to have to add his repo. And I'll put that on the screen right here, so you just add that repo. And then you can just type in SSL patch in the search bar, and it's going to pop up with this tweak. So if we do that, you can see SSL patch right there. Now before we actually install this, I do want to show you one thing. If we go into Safari here, and we type in go to fail.com, then you're going to see right here that it's going to tell me that my browser is vulnerable and I need to patch immediately. So this is basically a test site to test to see if your browser is vulnerable. So we're going to go ahead and install this and then we're going to go back to that site. And I'm going to show you that it has actually fixed this SSL bug. So here's the SSL patch. We're going to install that. And then once it installs and we respring our device, I'll go ahead and show you that website. All right, so now that we are resprung, you can see here that if I go into Safari and I reload this, you'll see that I don't get that error, and that is because this tweak by Ryan Petrich has actually fixed this vulnerability. Now, this is not a 100% fix. This will not work in some tweaks like Cydia and uh, as well as iFile. So it's not going to be there to protect you 100%. And that's why I do recommend upgrading to 7.0.6 to get a complete fix. So like I said, this is a quick fix. And if you want to do that until you actually have time to back up your device and back up your city of tweaks and restore, re jailbreak, all that good stuff, because it is kind of time consuming depending on how many times you've done it and how easy it is for you. So let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. And if you want to see more of my videos, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Alright guys, until next time, this is iTweaks with iPhoneHacks.com.